Hello guys, it's been a while since I haven't uploaded any video because of my busy schedule but today I'm going to share you guys the new things that I have learned. One is the adding of records using LinkQ to SQL. Okay, as usual guys, I'm going to show you my database first as a glimpse of it. I have here my practice database here practice database and then my phone book table and my phone book table properties here I have here my ID as the primary key contact name and the contact number okay now that you have seen my database guys let's go back to the program I already created a sample program here with the name of Windows Form Application 1 okay to start things up with the project, first thing you need to do is here at the add new item, add new item, at the data, choose the link you to SQL classes. Here, click on this and then at the name here you can just use the name of data, data classes one that dbml which is the default or anything that you want but for this video I'm just I'm not I'm just going to use the default name which is the data classes one that dbml and then once you are finished guys click on the add button okay now as you can see here guys here is now the data classes one that dbml which is what we add a while ago now after that go to the server explorer here the server explorer but if you can see the server explorer guys go to the view and then choose the server explorer or control plus w okay now, at the server explorer, here, at the data connection, click on the add connection. Now, the server name, since I have my, this is the server name of my computer, click on this one, and then, just click on the use windows authentication and then the database I'm going to use the practice which is the I'm going to use and then oops should be practice and then test the connection test connection succeeded and then okay and that's it we have now our data connection here already have a data connection to our practice database as you can see here guys here is my order list table order sheet phone book which is the table we are going to use now after that click on the phone book and then drag it to the or drag it inside the data classes one then here now as you can see inside the data classes one we have now the phone book table we have the ID which is the primary the contact name and the contact number now okay after that go back to the form one that CS that design here you can hide the server explorer now in here let's do some designing for a bit for the designing, just going to drag something. Let's drag here some label. The properties. You just add the label. You just uh, rename it. Let's say, for example, contact name. should be column and then 
this one this should be at the text mm, contact number okay and then drag some two text box then a save button for us to add it okay change the text to save let's resize this for a bit and then okay we are now finished on the designing I did not rename anything in here it, this is just default you notice this is just the uh, oops that shouldn't be the one properties text box one and text box two all are just the default name of the controls now okay to start the coding double click on the save button now we are at the save button start things up inside the button one underscore click let's create a new instance of the database we're going to create a new instance of the database or the new instance of the database object using the data classes so in here using data Plus context one db is equals to a new data plus context one. Alright. Okay. Once you've done that, guys, you now let's create a new instance of the phone book table itself. So okay, to do that here, create a new instance of object or let's say for example the table okay in here say phone book phone book table is equals to new that should be single equals only new phone book okay forget the semicolon and then here at the phone book table we're going to set set the records or the to add say phone book table that contact name is equals to text box text box one the text and then phone book table that contact number is equals to text box two the text okay now we have set the record that we are going to add and we're going to insert now the phone book table records that we add so to do that do the insert command db that phone books that insert on submit and then phone book entity which is the phone book table and then okay 
we have insert the or we, we have done the insert command but we did not do the sub changes to the database so okay so let's scroll down scroll it up for a bit here we have done the insert command and now we're going to do the submit changes submit changes to the database okay let's do some try catch here just to catch if anything or any error will be caught okay let's say exception ex is the variable for the exception and then if any error happen let's just type here message that should be message box X that the string now to do the submit changes to the or to the submit changes to the database type here TV that submit changes and okay that's it guys we have done the adding of records using link you to SQL server it's a little bit shorter than the previous adding of records to SQL server that I have shown you guys which is the using of SQL data adapter or in you would type so or you could just create any connection but in here you can just add some data class context one and then type a little shorter in here it's a lot easier than the SQL data adapter that I used to do as well and now let's test if the program is working click on the start or F5 okay it's built started let's just wait for it okay at the contact name let's say another contact or one two three four five six seven okay then click on the same let's check our database once you refresh the database as you can see here guys the another contact and the one two three four five six seven Okay guys, hope that you have learned something again and hoping it will be helpful to others as well. If you think you the, the video is helpful, you can just click on the like button or you can just subscribe to my channel and thanks again for watching guys.